Come on, we we need to get through the fence. Did they? She can't speak. We got a gag in her mouth. Give her back, you animals. She suffered enough. Hand over the stuff. Hand over Gracie. I'm here for you, sweetie. Hand over the fucking stuff. All right, calm down. Both of you. Oye, we put the ice in the middle. We walk back. Then, you send over the girl. We leave, and you pick up the stuff. Entiende? Sure. Show us the goods. Come back to me, honey. Let her go. We're going to pick up the stuff. All right. Nika Bellic. How is it? That whenever something is stolen from me, you are not far away. I have never stolen anything from you, Mr. Bulgarin. This man, the big pedic and his Dominican bitch, they stole my diamonds. And you have been trying to rob the thieves. To rob me. Gancha is I don't care what you did to that man, but we ain't leaving here without them diamonds. All right, I think I know who's got the ice. Follow me. Lot of them. Of him is like an army. But they are up.
us that fucking ice! You're trapped! We'll let you go if you give them up! <laughs> I'm screwed either way. If I don't give you the diamonds, you kill me here and you take them. I do give you the diamonds, Mr. Bogarin kills me later. I don't nobody having them. Screw all of you. Llévano esto. You selfish piece of cock sucking shit. You selfish cock sucking piece of shit. Shit, I don't want to spend another minute in this crap hole. Let's get out of here. It's no car. Fuck, fuck, fuck. All that trouble for nothing. Kidnapping the bitch. Holding on to her. Fighting through them damn Russians, all of that for jack shit. Look on the bright side. At least you got to meet Gracie. Screw that. I got close to knocking her teeth out. That was about it. We ain't got shit now. Maybe we was gonna have to give up them diamonds to fucking Ray Bacino, but we would have got a payday. Now we ain't getting shit. Yeah, but there is no guarantee we would have made any money out of those diamonds anyway. I've got the suspicion those were the ones Ray Bacino got me to handle a while back. They're bad luck. Me and some biker had to try to sell them to a diamond dealer, and it turns into a bloodbath. That was when those friends of Gracie's must have gotten them. Stole them from you, did they? No. They stole them from the guys I sold them to. Shit. These diamonds have been trouble since Ray first made me take them out of a trash can for them. It's good they are on their way to a landfill somewhere. Best place for them. The population of Liberty City would have been higher if we had. You might be right, Nico. Whose fucking diamonds were they anyway? They're not Ray's, I can tell you this much. Maybe they belong to this homosexual man, Gracie's friend. Well, I don't know, maybe to Bulgarin. Bulgarin? He the motherfucker who busted up our peaceful hostage exchange? What in Christ's name went on back there anyways? Some time ago, I worked for Mr. Bulgarin in Europe, smuggling people across the Adriatic. The ship sunk. The cargo sunk to the bottom of the sea. I had to swim for my life. Bulgarin had lost a lot of money that night and he needed someone to blame. This was one of the reasons I leave Europe and come here to Liberty City. And now he shows up claiming the ice belongs to him. What are the chances? Our paths crossed back when I was living in Holt's Beach as well. My cousin and I moved up to Bohem to get away from him and another man called Dimitri Raskolov. That's a real shame. I can see you fitting right in down in Holt Beach, Nico. Probably a good we used thing to get out though. Wouldn't have met me if you'd stayed, would you? When you put it like this, I'm one lucky motherfucker, Becky. Have a nice day. What is this car doing? Oh, we got a lot of speed now. Jesus fucking Christ! We had a lot of speed, now we got a ruined car. But we got one headlight working, it's working very good. Well, Nico, that was a whole lot of effort for no fucking reward. Story of my life. It is the story of a lot of lives, Becky. I'm getting used to hearing it. See you, Nico. I gotta go break the news to Gerald. At least I'm gonna be on the other side of some bulletproof glass to him. But you know what? I'm still fucking scared. Good luck. Hey, Ray. I got some bad news for you. 
You weren't the only one who thought they owned those diamonds. Turns out the serious Russian called Bulgarin claims ownership as well. Damn it, Nicky, cut the bullshit! You got them? Where are they? Liberty City dump? I don't know. They got thrown into traffic. See, we do need. Pull over. Okay, let's get back to. Um, okay. Him. Where to? So we need to go to Beaverhead Avenue. Dragon, you gotta expect a few knights are gonna turn up to try to slay him. <laughs> Jackasses, all of them, all of you. Nice talking with Whatever. you. Whatever. You have fun. Pick a swell guy to kill. Hopefully, someone with a young family who really miss him. Hey! Hey! Is Mr. Pegorino around? Oh, uh, uh, sure. I I'll get him. Boss! Anthony, will you shut up? In fact, will you fuck off? Go on, get out of here. Mm. Don't come back till you get a brain implant or something. I'm sorry. I I'm s nice to see you, Nico. You too. I got a couple of things I want to talk to you about. First up, can you kill this shithead? Sure. <laughs> Second, come in here. Oh, fuck. So, listen, we got a bit of a problem with the Pavanos. Yes, I noticed that, that you're meeting with them. The way they look at us, we're bottom feeders. Always have been. We ain't a real family to them. Just a bunch of Guernsey Goombas. When things are cool, we're getting fucked. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, sure. Listen, some of their boys are in town today. Gonna collect their piece of an old and a bookie ring. Where it is, they're at the diner in Acta. Find them and follow them to the meet. You disrupt it, and I'll let you keep the money. But make sure you hit the Pavanos real hard, Kabish. Yeah, Kabish. Thank you. Let's take this car. It's a fast one. Mention something about money. Not like we need anymore. for the Pegorinos. God, they must be desperate. Let's lose them on the way to the meet. Oh, sorry.
Oh. 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 Okay. I don't think I need to kill them, do I? Faster if you go this way. There's no way here. I can't, can't shake them properly. That was close. I got that stuff, Jimmy. Well done, my boy. I hope you made him suffer. Teach him that more than a Pecorino turn. Is there a nice little haul in it for you? All right. Well, maybe you'll give me a little taste in it. And something up the left. That's how us Italians been doing things for centuries. Good thing I'm not Italian. Shit. So we need to see Phil. working for a mafia family. They're scum. The Pegorinos? They're not a family. Gravelli is the only man who can get what you need done. He's in Shotla Medical Center. Tell him you were sent by a mutual friend. He's expecting you. All right. 
Uh, sure. Please, come on through. Hey, Tommy, check this out. Seven holes, seven race. Hey, Joe Phil. What? Hey, pal. What's going on? Not too much. How are you? I'm good. Want to walk and talk? Sure. Tommy, give me a call for my big buddy. Phil. Tell him I went out to get some fresh air. No problem. Ridiculous. I'm a grown man walking around like a chump. I'm sorry about this. Hey, no problem. So you're a friend of Ray's? <laughs> a friend? No, oh, I do some work for him. No, I mean a friend. I don't understand. Whatever you say, he's the slime ball, but uh, he pays. <laughs> sure, pal, sure. Listen to me. The thing about Ray is, he's a good earner. He talks a lot of shit, but he's a good earner. Maybe. He's hmm? a rat doing an impression of a man. <laughs> That's pretty good. Phil! Phil! What? What? What do you want? <coughs> Mr. Boss, said you gotta head down to docks. Emergency. Said you'd understand. Ah, oh, shit. It's three days early. Man on the meal. What am I gonna do? What's the problem? Nico. I'm gonna have to take a chance with you, pal. Okay? Come on, let's go. Okay, well, listen, there's a truck waiting for us. It's under the overpass on oops. Catskill Avenue. Drive us there. Alright. You're trying to attract attention! No, no, I'm just smashing into everything. You scan this thing for bugs? No, but we can be pretty sure it's clean. Chill out. All right, all right. It's just that if we get caught on this one, you and me is going down for a long time. And that means that certain people is going to assume we're rat, which means we'll get whacked. You're working with the wrong people if you expect them to whack you if you go inside. Where's the trust, Bill? It's about survival. If someone who knew what I knew got flipped, then the whole organization will down. Whacking someone who catches some heavy time is just an insurance policy. And it don't help that not everyone in the organization is pulling in the same direction. You mean that someone in the family would see someone else going inside as an opportunity to get the head? You're a smart guy. Anyways, excuse me if I want to be absolutely sure that we got our asses covered. You're excused. What are we doing? We're taking a load of product off of some Russians the enchiladas have been dealing with. You was helping those oh. Irish idiots cause some beef between the enchiladas and their Albanian muscle partner. Since that little love affair ended, they've been getting this Russian guy to supply them with sea. We just got the heads up that a shipment has arrived in Liberty City by boat. That's what the talk about the docks was. Exactly. We're taking the sea off the Russians so they can't deliver it to the Angelans. Sounds straightforward. We take the cook. All right, this is the truck. Charge Island? Going to an island? Yes, pretty quite a journey. It should be a lot of sugar. But that ain't the only reason why we're taking this truck. Some of my boys stole it from the enchiladas this morning. It's the one the Russians are expecting to come pick up the sea. We should be able to turn up and have them load it up for us. Then we drive away, no questions asked. I don't know if anyone will give away a load of coke without asking any questions. Even the Russian coke runners ain't that stupid. Yeah, sure, this is just plan A. It's the one Jimmy P worked out. You and me know it ain't gonna work. And that the only way we're gonna be able to leave that place with the sugar is if all the Russians in there are dead. So why don't we use a more subtle approach? Not just drive right into the middle of it. Because these is the orders and we gotta follow them. That's the way things work. You ain't gonna be happy about everything you get told to do, are you? You're the boss. It ain't like I'm working for free. No, you ain't. And I ain't neither. That's why we gotta at least try to do what we're told to do. You're gonna learn that there ain't much in this life that you got control of. Whether you're putting yourself in harm's way because that's the way the skipper wants it done, or you're staying away from your kids because of a stupid court order and a malicious bitch of an ex-wife. There ain't that much control in anything. I've been around long enough to know that there are some things that we don't have a choice about. But there's other times where you got to look at something and make a decision for yourself. I can't follow every order I'm given. Yeah, well, maybe you're right. Maybe you ain't. I don't know. It's gonna be fine. We're almost there. 
Why didn't we go this way? Why couldn't we just go straight forward? It would be the same outcome. Sure to have the feds on us. It's going good. We almost keep a cool head and everything should be fine. Buddy, we're here to pick up the shipment. I don't speak English. Fuck off. Hey, amigo, let's make this easy. I just want to give the stuff to my boss and go home. I don't let anyone in here until I get the word. There's something wrong about you. Get out of the truck real slow. Nico, looks like we're going to have to do this the old-fashioned way. Shoot these commies. Are so good. Probably gonna get chased. Still take a few more if uh, if they come. 
almost full HP with decent amount of ammo as well. Things are fine. You handled yourself real good back there. Kept your head. That's a valuable trait. Thank you. See you later. Yeah, that's good. And the cab. Perfect. So we need. This is what you have to hear. And we miss them all. Go cry to your therapist. You love to disappoint me, Nico Pelic. You really do. Are you disappointed that I have not found and killed you yet, Dmitri Raskolov? Do not worry. Your time will soon come. I went to the sewage works on Charge Island. I picked through the bodies, and yours was not amongst them. Very disappointing. I'm sorry. Or maybe the thugs who failed to kill me should be blamed, though. I cannot believe that you would steal from my friend Ray Bulgarin twice. First in Europe, and then these diamonds in Liberty City. You are in debt to him, Nico. Why don't you just pay him what you owe, and we can all get along? I have no debts to Bulgarin, Dimitri. And the only thing I owe you is a bullet to the temple. You will be paid in full. Fear not. You have a sharp tongue, Nico. It's only a matter of time before it is cut out of your mouth. Goodbye. He's very upset. Where you want to go? Big nose. Georgie, I think we're Three missions, all right. So we're going to Mahesh Avenue. They just keep piling okay, up. Okay, here we are, Bucko. What? 
What does it say? What? Nico, I've been invited to your cousin's wedding. I didn't think you guys knew each other. Nor did I. He called me up and said that you really liked me and wanted me to be there. Is that true, Nico? I guess it is. I'll see you at the wedding then. It's good. Another another save then. Alright, gonna be stopping there for the night. We will continue with this tomorrow at 8 pm, Central PM summertime. Doing pretty good. Closing on half a million as well. No idea what we need to do with so much money though. Buying ammo. So tomorrow we will be starting with um Bete. Well, he was there first, so we could start with the game better tomorrow. Maybe. We'll see. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, I'll see you all tomorrow. Until then, take care and good night, everyone. Goodbye.